The Nigerian Stock Exchange opened trading for the week on Monday with a loss of 35 billion naira amid weak sentiments. Market capital, which opened at 13.145 trillion naira, inched lower by 35 billion or 0.27% to close at 13.110 trillion naira. Also, the All Share Index lost 67.17 points or 0.27% to close at 25,132. Uh, 0.67 from 25,199.84 achieved on Friday. The downturn was impacted by losses recorded in medium and large capitalized stocks. Analysts at United Capital PLC predicted that the market would witness mixed performances this week due to anticipated profits taken by short-term players. And we would quickly bring in uh, Yomi Fane to have uh, a conversation and make sense out of uh, all of this. Thank you so much for joining us, Yomi. Good morning. Thanks for having me. $35 billion naira loss is, is pretty huge, don't you think? Quickly take us through the numbers. $35 billion, it sounds um, like a big loss. It was a loss taken by the company, it would be that same But um, since it's uh, just a loss in the whole um, capitalization of the project, it's not um, really a big loss. And the way the market is designed, uh, prices will go up and prices will come down. So, like last week, the market opened with a loss, but at the end of the week, it was um, a profit. So the, the, it, it could be the same trend with this week. So as a result of results coming out, um, quarterly results coming out, and um, investors taking All right, and, and how, how has this loss impacted on medium and large stocks? Um, it, it, it hasn't taken much impact. Unless on those that are investing in index, you know, so if, if there is a gain in the total index, unless you're an index investor, if you're investing in individual stocks, it doesn't really take um, much impact. So the possibility for the index to be down and then you are in the up, and it could be the other way around as well. Okay, and of course, do you have quick predictions for the week uh, from what it looks like right now? Um, and as results are still coming in. Especially from the two big banks, Zenith and GC Bank, um, investors are waiting and um, definitely waiting to take position. Many will be taking profits, many will be holding. So it, it's the usual. We just need to wait and see what happens next week. All right. And just before we let you go, I want to know if you feel this should put fear in investors and uh, people who you know, want to put their money in there. Sure, I think it does. Uh, just before we let you go, I want to know if you think that these, you know, losses should put fear in potential investors. Um, they shouldn't. It's good. It's, the, the, the way the market starts, investors get careful when prices start dropping, and people get greedy when prices start going up. One thing is that as an investor, you should have your strategy, and you should stick with it, regardless of how the market is. So it shouldn't put in fear. To an invest into the mind of an investor, we know what we're doing. Thank you so much, uh, Yomi Fane, for speaking with us. You're welcome. Thanks for having me.